Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to IL2 Sturmovic. Let's all get shot down. Edition. Last time, our entire flight was killed in action apart from us. We managed to bail. Um, we probably, in hindsight, shouldn't have engaged a formation of enemy fighters much larger than us, but at the same time, I couldn't just... I couldn't deal with just having shot at a 110 and then ever had everyone return to base. I felt like we had to do something. Since the bombers got away completely unscathed. Um, but yeah, we all paid for it, unfortunately. Which is a damn shame. So it's August 28th. Getting near to the end of August and beginning of September. It can't be more than a couple more missions before we move on to the final phase of the Battle of Britain, actually. Um... In this, in this part of it, we've not done too badly, actually. We had a pretty dodgy start, but towards the middle, we've gotten all right. I mean, the last mission was a major hiccup, I'll grant you that, but um, we're doing okay. We've still got plenty of pilots still around that actually have kills and whatnot. Uh, Wing to Commander Bloom is sat on his ass doing nothing, sadly. I'd like to bring him with this once in a while. But we're doing okay. We made it to Flight Lieutenant. 15 kills, 14 sorties. Um... We're not doing too bad at all, um, and it looks like we've made it through most of August. If hopefully, if we survive this, we'll make it to the next phase of the campaign. Because um, I think we'll probably get another mission on that. Was, last time it was August twenty sixth, so um, looks like we might make and get another mission on August thirtieth, and that'll be the end of August and the beginning of September. And I, be I believe. September 1940 is the next part of the campaign where the Germans start trying to attack London. And we will be defending London. We'll also hopefully get given Spitfire Mark 2As at that point. So this could be one of our last couple of missions in the Mark 1. Either way, let's fly. And see what Fighter Command has deigned to send to help us today. If it's another three fucking hurricanes, I swear to God I'm going to strangle someone. <laughs> Uh Sometime today game would be nice. Before I have to edit out this load, thank you. Whee. Can you tell I'm a bit impatient, guys? I am. I'm a bit disappointed with the last mission. It's probably showing. Alright, what do we got today? It's us four, and you have got to be joking. <laughs> Screw you two, game! Screw you two! Holy shit! It's like it was listening. I'm being trolled. Um, either that or Fight the Command's taken such a beating, there's nothing left to help us. But I know for a fact that's not true, because we've got an entire freaking squadron. Alright then, well, it looks like it's just us four. Holy shit, am I going to play it conservatively today? <laughs> Alright then, well. Ground control, can we take off? I'd rather not, but... Uh... Damn. Um, <laughs> that's all I have to say to that. Come again? We, we have bombers in the air? What the? Just, just one cotton picking minute here. Yeah, look at that, we've got Blenheims. Blenheims with an escort of hurricanes. Well, that's certainly interesting. I wonder what they're off to do. Wow, there's quite a lot of them, isn't there? Look. Looks like it's the Poles. Some of them are Poles, anyway. The Blenheims aren't, but yeah, it looks like the whole freaking Pover Squadron's out in force protecting some uh, Blenheims. My god, I wonder where they're going. Pro well, France, is, I, I, I assume. Um, well, yeah, look, there they are. Huh. Well, that is not something you see every day. Certainly not in this campaign, it seems. Well, let's go. Maybe they'll distract some of the Germans for us. But uh, anyway, uh, like I said, I'm going to be playing conservatively as hell today. If we see If we get outnumbered like we were last time, and we see a bunch of guys below us that we can't possibly hope to, hope to kill all of, um, we're going home. Simply put. 
I'm hoping the game isn't going to be that unfair on us, but uh, honestly, you never know. Alright, looks like everyone's getting off the ground in due fashion. In a timely, timely fashion is what I meant to say there. My brain screwed it up, though, so never mind. Um, yep. Alright then, well, I will be back, guys, when we're up at around 20,000 feet-ish. And we're in the Folkestone area. And I will be keeping an eye on this Blenheim um, attack force, or whatever. Um, and I'll be interested to see what they're up to. Because they're obviously off to bomb something. Probably German shipping, I imagine, actually. In order to try and prevent an invasion. Although, come to think of it, this is a dynamic campaign. So, does this lot going off to bomb ships mean that we've been sucking so bad the Germans are about to invade? You never know. Uh, we'll find out, I guess. That, where are they headed, anyway? Same direction as us, roughly, interestingly enough. Well, kind of, actually. We're headed more off, sort of, this way. Well, either way, I'll see you guys at high altitude. Alright, we've arrived at... Uh, just over RAF Limp, I think. Um, very high at this time, around 25,000 feet. Oh, we're down at 24,000. Yeah, I went a little bit too high there with the climbing. Got a bit sidetracked. Meantime, let's see what the... Yeah, it looks like these guys are headed straight for the Cat Grenade. Interesting. Cat Grenade is that pointy bit over there. One wonders what they are bombing. We may never find out. However, our job is to patrol this sort of general area, and that's what we're going to do. So, maybe nothing will come up. Maybe we'll not find anything. I'm half tempted to bugger off there with the Blenheims and the Hurricanes and sort of give them a hand, but orders are orders, so... I guess we'll just float around for a bit. See you guys when we find something. Alright, well, I still haven't had anything called out. But, uh, well, it sounds like the Poles and the Blenheims managed to destroy their target on the other side of the channel, which is good news. Looks like they went completely un unhindered because I didn't hear any messages. However, you see that? I can see traces down there. I think something's going on down at the airfield. I think a bomb might have just exploded or something there. Yeah, something definitely going on down there. We're just too high up to give it a good look at it. So I'm going to, yeah, I'm going down to 0% throttle. Red flight, tactical, stay in formation, and so we know what's down there. Well, I mean, it's not, it's not like I did anything wrong, we were at the briefing altitude, so... There's something definitely going on down here. Might be Yavos, which are German fighter bombers harassing the place, I don't know. There hasn't been like a whole huge load of explosions, so... It looks like, yeah, they're strafing. Some guys are aggressing out to sea over there. Aha! Uh -huh. Well, look at this. Well, looky here! We found ourselves some krauts. Yeah, 9 o'clock low, I see them. Still with me? They are excellent. Alright, this could post potent this has the potential to be an excellent little dogfight. Because there's not too many of them. What are they exactly? One of nines, yeah, I think they're Yarbos. Attack fighters, cover me. I'm going in. Oh, okay, there is actually quite a few down here, to be fair, but never mind. We'll give it a go anyway, I suppose. They're low and slow, and we've got the benefit of flat cover, so... I 
like this guy looks like he might be getting ready to have a pop at me, or maybe not. Where is this? So oh, it's a 110. Get a bit sick of 110s actually. I'm gonna be honest. Whatever. Alright, gave him a raking. I'll break off him for now. Let's head over here to help the other two. If we can, anyway. He's messing up another 110. What about you? Another 110. I sh swore I saw some 109s down here. Come on. There we go. Both engine smoking, good enough for me. How about you? You want some? Right, this guy. Maybe. After that one down there on my low nine o'clock, rather than sticking on this fella, he's getting away anyway. Good grief, it's going fast. Must be going full throttle down there. Looks like they might be trying to break away back from France right now, actually. How about you? I think this is the one I shot at earlier, actually. He's damaged, he's not a priority. This guy is, though. Right, Sonny, you're having a bad day, aren't you? <laughs> nice, he's definitely going down. Right. Probably going to be low on ammo in a minute, but... Oh, still straight from the field, are we? Well then. Like I said, I just could have sworn I saw some 109s down here, but I guess not. Looks like it was all 110s. Two engine smoking. I think I'm almost out of ammo. You know what, wingman? Just get stuck in, guys. Come on. Or do these maybe? No, they don't count as bombers. So they did wonder. Hopefully some of these guys... I haven't damaged them enough, half of them, to actually get them completely. What are you doing? He's pulling away, okay. But hopefully some of these are going to crash on their way back. I imagine with two smoky engines, you'd, well, you'd think they would, but we'll see. I've only literally only probably got about ten bullets left, but if I place it carefully enough, we might be able to do some damage. No, I am completely out, never mind. Well, come on, where is everyone? You should be killing things. Okay. Come on. Uh-oh. What's going on? Oh, I think I must have knocked the prop pitch down to 30 degrees there, and I didn't mean to, never mind. I thought my engine was dying. Unless it is. I'm not trailing smoke. What the hell's going on? 
Okay, yeah, there we go. It was prop pitch. Whoops. Don't stop covering me. Seriously. Kill things. Don't don't follow me. Oh, do I need to tell you to disengage or something? Uh, tactical. No. Ah, damn it. That was the ex exact opposite of what I wanted to do. Break. Attack fighters. Right, hopefully that'll, that'll do it. No, our wingman's still sticking to us like glue, which, to be fair, is kind of his job, but then again, I have specifically told him, go shoot stuff. Because I'm out of ammo, and we could go back right now, but I sort of hope want my teammates to shoot a few more of these bastards down. Although, we've got half our tank left, which is fine. Or at least hopefully we can keep these guys engaged long enough for them to run out of ammo. I mean, not ammo, but for their engines to die, like that guy there. So I could, you know, start incompetent, friendly AI at it again. Good grief. You give them a slow-moving, already damaged target and they can't even get close to hitting it. I swear, it's times like this, I wish this plane had cannons, because we could have wrecked these guys if we had. Oh, one's gone down. Hang around and keep this guy moving around. Hopefully, someone will take some shots at him. Seriously, wingman. Break. Kill things. But you're not attacking bandits, are you? You're just following me. Looks like the poles are run into something. Wingman. Uh, attack my target, maybe? Maybe that will do something, I don't know. What? Seriously? No, you're fine. I guess that must be... One of the Blenheims, I guess? Oh, no, wait, hello. Oh, God, come on, guys. Kill this guy, come on. Stop messing around and shoot, unless you're out of ammo as well, which, in which case, fair enough, I suppose. This is the last one, the others have tried, I think, buggered off or crashed at this point. Oh, if I had ammo, if I had ammo, you'd be so dead. Yeah, you idiots are just following me, aren't you? Oh, oh Christ. Uh, red flight, screw it. We're going home. Of course, that's said. How about red flight, navigation, loiter here? And then attack things. Look, this guy's shooting one of our wingmen, okay. guys. Come on, do something about it. Do I have to ram this guy? Seriously? Because I will. Ugh. Idiots. Never mind. Wing Commander Bloom was here, he wouldn't be uh, doing this. He'd be kicking ass. How are you not dead yet? Ugh. Thank you. 
Alright, I'm gonna hope it's because these guys are out of ammo and uh, not because they're stupid. Red flight, navigation, return to base, we're going home. At least all three of them are still alive, I guess there's that. I'm thankful for small mercies and all that. Maybe some of the poles will get rid of these guys on their way back over. I hope so. Except, oh great, look, one of them's chasing me. Uh, Right, let's go full throttle. Or maybe, if I do that, they'll actually start attacking things. Ooh, they might be, you know. This might be the way to do it. <laughs> yeah, that's right, turn with me, you stupid BF-110. Well, those two idiots are still leaving, but... Uh. Oh, screw it. Yeah, those, so those guys are pretty set on heading home by the looks of things. I suppose we are kind of bingo fuel at this point, so it does sort of make sense, but still. Oh, he's running away. <laughs> he's running away big time. Alright. Actually, you know what? Don't return to base. Rejoin. You can follow me in. Right, which way is base? This way. Ish. I think you know what? He's turned around, that guy in the mirror up there. But, but I think we're getting away regardless, so fine. Alright, guys. Um, after that weird mission, we'll call it. Um, very weird indeed. I suppose I'll be heading back and I'll meet you guys back at the airstrip when uh, I go in for my landing. So, tidy bye. Well, we're back. Looks like some people have already landed, actually. Yep. Is that Blenheim down there? Possibly. Um, and we also got shared kill on the way back. Evidently someone crashed that someone else had already shot at. So I guess these guys aren't completely useless. Um, they evidently were shooting at stuff. And I guess the reason they weren't attacking there is because, yeah, they were out of ammo. So fair play, I suppose. Oh, nice. Look at that. Another one went down. <laughs> awesome. Two and a half kills. Alright then, well. Ground control. Press for landing. Awesome. Uh, red flight. Navigation. Return to base. And you. Oh no, he's probably going to do it by himself. I don't need to order the wingman independently. Alright, let's do this. We're already lined up on one of the runways anyway, so we might as well. And slide side slip a bit here to slow down. Wait a minute. Oh, for the love of fucking Christ! Look, it's one of the it's one of the one tens. He's followed us all the way back. Ugh. Gotta be joking. How are you not out of fuel yet, you weirdo? Maybe the base flat guns will kill him, I hope so. Oh, running away now, are you? Come here, I'll bite your legs off. Yeah, he's buggering off. <laughs> oh, look, at least we got more guys coming in. Looks like he might be off to try and shoot the other fellow. I hope so. Meantime, I'm going to try and land. Get down. Brilliant. Is someone else coming in to land on this runway? They are, aren't they? Christ. Fine, we'll, run, we'll land on the other runway then. Ugh. It's a mess. 
Hey, look, they're shooting at the 110, finally. Don't have time to gawk, though, I'm afraid. I'm about to go wheels down. Uh... Alright, 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 nice and slow, slowly does it. Wheel flaps up, and plop. There we go, three point landing, that's what I like to see. Looks like the Blenheims are parked over there, and some of the Hurricanes. Why don't we go park over near though, them, just for fun. that 110 in a minute, well, the guy's chasing him and see if he bites the dust, because I really hope he does. Alright, brakes on, brakes on. There we go. Perfect. Engine off. Open and hello, fellow Emin, I suppose. Right then, well, let's see. In between all the landing spam in the radio messages, what else is going on? Turn off the head tracking, let's see what's going on. Um, there's the 110, and these guys seem to be chasing him. I apologise if there's sound in the background, guys, by the way, at the minute. I'm going to see if I can try and cover it up with the, um, with the game volume, but, um, yeah. Well, this is, again, the problem with recording during the middle of the day rather than at night. It gets a bit busy. So, well, he's got one engine smoking. Come on, Tweedledum and Tweedledee, you can do it. There's four of you. Get this guy. Come on. Kill him. Get him. Well. Might be going to crash, I don't know. Oh well, looks like maybe he's gonna live to fight another day, the little cheeky bastard. No mind, I'm gonna quit now, I think. Let's see what we got for that. Wow, look at all the blue. <laughs> So, let's see, four Spitfire 1s, Dave, Smith, Stewart, Sedgwick, versus 10 BF-110s. That was it. Oh, fair enough, I guess the, I guess the, the, the dynamic campaign generator didn't screw us over this time. Um, let's see, uh. Oh, looks like we went and bombed an airfield. Nice! Gave them a taste of their own medicine. Yeah, it looks like one of the, where yeah, one of my 110s crashed on landing. This one I shared with Flight Sergeant Smith. That one crashed in the channel. I got this guy. He crashed just off of Folkestone. Shot down, shot down, shot down by player. Wait a minute. How many kills did I get then? During this mission, you've destroyed four. <laughs> Whoa! Four kills. 
<laughs> is that like because the, uh, the, the the shared one added up to something or what? Let's see. Shot down my player. Shot down. Shot down. Shot down my player. So that's two. Player and flight sergeant Smith. So that's two and a half. That's three. So wait, did I do the most most of the damage on the shared one, and that means I got it, or did I just get it because I'm a higher rank or something? Huh. Well, either way, we got four freaking kills. <laughs> Man, that, see, that's what you can do to BF one tens that don't have an escort. You know, when when your 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 own AI friendly AI doesn't suck completely, mind you, because God, the number of times I've seen Spitfires in this campaign shot down by one tens. Um. Damn, look at that. Confirmed kills 19 in total. You've performed exceptionally in this mission. Your actions deserve to be studied by all pilots. <laughs> Bloody hell. Well, it looks like we deserve the promotion. God, we're, we're one hell of a flight lieutenant, aren't we? I feel pretty badass right about now. We kicked their asses. Nice. Let's apply. See what goes on. See what happens. Today we will cover London. It's September 1st, guys, I think. Either we're... Uh, okay, right, now we're covering Biggin Hill and Canley, right? It's not quite over yet, but soon. Um, God, I wonder if it begins in September or whether that'll be October when we start defending London. I'm pretty sure it should be September, but whatever. Because we've still got Spitfire 1s, as you can see. Um... Although, that said, we might have just advanced the next part of the campaign. And um, it just, they just left us with Spitfire 1s. I thought they would give us Spitfire 2s because I selected them on the campaign screen at the beginning. But maybe it doesn't work like that, to be fair. Maybe they, it just gives you whatever. Um, I'll have to double check when the next part of the campaign actually begins, actually. But in the meantime, yeah, we're defending London... Looks like we're defending airfields at London, though. We're not defending London itself, so... Even though it says London, we're covering London, but that's just because it's the nearest uh, city. So, we are okay, well, what do we got then? Flight Lieutenant Dave, Harper, Stuart, Smith. How are those guys? Harper's a newbie, isn't he? I think, yeah, two sorties. Smith, five sorties, no kills. Stuart, 13 and one kill. Okay, so another bunch of... Basically rookies, I suppose. Although Stuart's been around a fair while, I suppose. Um, yeah. That's what we'll be doing next time. 24,000 feet, nice and high up, it seems. Covering our own airfields this time. Over here at Biggin Hill and Kenley. So that could be interesting. Hmm, interesting indeed. Gust light, turbulence light. Nothing about thunderstorms. <laughs> um... All right then, well, next time, folks, that's what we're going to be doing. It's a squadron scramble, by the looks of things. And uh, hopefully we won't we won't embarrass ourselves. We've been doing pretty well so far, all, aside from a few hiccups here and there, so we'll see. Anyway, that'll be next time, so I'll catch you then.